New at 10 tonight, a movie being filmed in Oakland right now features some big name stars, famous directors, and a Bay Area rapper. The movie is hoping to raise the city's profile, but as KTVU's Henry Lee shows us, some business owners are not happy about streets being turned into live action sets. They didn't help Oakland at all. They helped Hollywood, and Hollywood ran roughshod all over Oakland, and Oakland allowed it. Glenn Kaplan is angry. He says a movie being made in Oakland has shut down streets and cost him business with no advance warning. This after merchants are being challenged by COVID and smashing grabs. We got no notification, zero update, no compensation. Kaplan owns Make Westing, a bar at 17th and Telegraph in the heart of downtown Oakland. He says filming has gone beyond posted times. They tried to put porta potty in front of our bar. They tried to move our neighbor's parklet that was rat infested in front of our bar. I'm talking about two short. Well known Bay Area rapper Too Short is executive producing the movie Freaky Tales, inspired by his iconic song. The movie is set in 1987, Oakland. They blocked off the area so there was no parking. Our regulars who live in the neighborhood were furious because 1980s film cars were sitting here. It's a star studded affair that includes the co directors of the Captain Marvel superhero film. But Kaplan is super annoyed. And this love letter of a film to Oakland is going to destroy Uptown and revert it back, and it's going to be a lose, lose, lose. Situation. Supporters say the movie is good for Oakland. This past weekend, Mayor Libby Schaff was on hand as the city renamed part of Foothill Boulevard after Too Short. All the glitz and glamour, a stark contrast to empty storefronts downtown. So they cost us $30,000 at a time where we have no capital and cannot afford any loss like that. I got fish sandwiches. Tina Johnson owns Mama T's restaurant downtown. She thought the movie would bring her more business, but she says food for those working the film was catered. How about patronizing the business, spending some money? Since I'm here, I got employees, I got to pay, and you don't spend any money with me on this multi-million dollar film? You're circling for parking, and now you see these big trucks taking up two or three, four times the parking space. Nina Joyner also owns a business downtown. We need to have more coordination with the small businesses, as well as the city of Oakland and also the film crew as well. The city of Oakland says they're working with film officials to try to minimize disruptions. Now, some residents say they have gotten flyers with a number to call with any concerns or complaints. That number goes straight to a voicemail. In Oakland, Henry Lee, KTVU, Fox 2 News.